So the double slit is a key experiment both in the development of quantum mechanics and also in, frankly, how we teach quantum mechanics. But there have been many experiments that have profoundly shaped our understanding of the quantum world. And the photoelectric effect, which is an experiment that predates the double slit experiment, guided Einstein's thinking, which really was what allowed him to write the first paper on quantum physics. That's this idea that if you have a piece of metal and you shine light on the metal, electrons fly off if you set up the experiment the right way. But the remarkable thing is that the energy that the electrons have is not actually determined by the intensity of the light. That's what you'd think. More light, greater energy of the electrons that get shot off. That's not what happens. It's the color of the light that determines the energy of the ejected electrons. And Einstein ultimately realized that the way to think about that is light itself needs to be thought of in terms of a bath of photons that are raining down on the piece of metal. And the color of the light is what determines the energy of each individual photon. So the energy of the photon determines the energy of the electron that gets ejected, and the energy of the photon is dependent upon the color of the light. This is what allowed Einstein to realize that light itself needs to be described in terms of particles. Previously, we thought of it in terms of a wave. This experiment allowed us to recognize that light needs to be thought of in terms of particles.